Moving right along into the Perks and Leveling section of the guide. First mod we're going to install is Ordinator Perks of Skyrim. Ordinator overhauls the perk trees of Skyrim with over 400 perks to improve the depth and fun of building and playing your character. It establishes this in a lightweight, compatible, and clean fashion. One of my favorite mods of all time, anything by Anai Scion. Okay, so we got two files. We're going to download Ordinator 9.3.1 and Thief Skills Rebalance for Ordinator. So let's click on download. Wait a minute, JT. We forgot one essential step. Let's create that separator. So I'm copying this here. Going over to Mod Organizer, onto the tiny wrench and spanner here. Create separator and paste. Phew, disaster averted. All right, let's download Ordinator. So 9.3.1, let's go download that. And scroll down to here, Thief Skills Rebalance for Ordinator. Let's download that. And we're gonna install this as two separate mods. So first, Ordinator. There it is, Ordinator Perks of Skyrim. Do we want to unpack this BSA? No, we do not. Very nice. Thief Skills Rebalance for Ordinator. All right. We don't want to name it the same. We do not want to merge these mods. So drop down. Thief Skills Rebalance for Ordinator. Very good. Let's go ahead and activate those and move on. So, Ordinator for Spell Perk Item Distributor. This mod gives Ordinator perks to most enemies to make the game a little bit more challenging. And there's a warning here. We'll go over that after we install it. So let's go ahead and download it. Version 1.51, or actually the safe version, version one, right here. So download, files, and we're gonna download the safe version. Change follower support a bit, good. Okay, close that out. Now let's install it. And yeah, we wanna keep the name. Content data does not look valid. So right click, set as data. And here we're going to choose two regular because it says so right here. Pick two regular, no followers. 100% chance from the archive. So right click, set as data directory. And we want 100% chance because it says so right here. Right click, set as data directory. And here we're good. Click OK. All right. So once you set the 100% chance as data directory, and Motu will warn there is no valid game data. This is correct behavior since the mod is just an INI file, and Motu currently doesn't understand this file structure, but the mod will be loaded correctly by the game. Uh, as you saw, we got no warning. It said it was good to go. So there might have been an update from MO2 since these uh, no, this, since this note was uh, posted. So you know what? We're good. Go ahead and activate that. All right. Oh, look. Here's an example. See? This optional file for Ordinator, it has uh, the date and not a version number, but don't worry about it. Unless it really bothers you, then feel free to add it. I'm not going to do it. All right. The Eloquent Reader, True Scholar, SC Edition. The Dragonborn became a True Scholar and gains the ability to increase his speech craft by reading books. I like it. Gives you another source of uh, leveling for your speech, which can be annoying. And there's two files here, a main file and an optional file and it looks like we are not going to be wait make sure to merge the main file and optional files together all right so in this case we're going to merge it so download files so first domain file download and we want the one with less experience optional less xp main file needed and download that close it out so let's install the main file first which is the yeah, if you make sure you uh, expand it to know what you're doing. We don't want the, we want to install the less XP optional second. So install the main file first. We'll keep that name. Okay. And now we're gonna install the optional, and we're not gonna change this name because we want to merge it. So okay. And click on merge. Okay. And let's go ahead and activate it. Very nice. Delete install downloads. Clean that up. Okay. We're not missing any additional steps. Okay, custom skills framework. This mod allows mod authors to create an unlimited amount of new custom skills with their own perk trees. Very nice. Let's go and download that. Files. Main file version one, yes. Download it. Okay, now let's install it. Double click. Name is good. Okay. Activate. Delete. Okay, see that little heart right here with the question mark? 
it means that I have never endorsed this mod because I probably never installed this mod. This is probably my very first time. So if I try to endorse it now by right clicking it and endorse, it's not letting me. Oh, wait a minute. No, apparently I have downloaded this before. But anyways, um, you can endorse mods straight from Mod Organizer 2 from here. You can even unendorse them if you chose. I choose to endorse all mods because I think the mod authors deserve it. All right, experience. Gain levels by completing quests and exploring. Skills don't contribute to the character's level anymore. Very good, very good. Changes the dynamic of leveling. You don't have to worry about um, over-leveling, say, alchemy, and now your uh, offensive abilities are weak, and now NPCs are just a little too tough for you. All right, so let's go do that. Main file, experience, download. Files. And we're going to download the main file. All right, close it up. And let's install it. Boom. Experience. Okay. And looks like we're going to delete something. So open up experience. Right click on it. Open an explorer. We're going into uh, SKSC plugins. And we're going to delete the experience folder. Because it says so right there. Delete. Nice. All right. Let's go and activate it. Now Lexi's experience uh, INI. This mod is a custom INI file for mod experience. Especially tailored for use with this guide. It's going to be in a miscellaneous section. We're looking for Lexi's experience INI. So download files. Scroll down to the miscellaneous section. Here's a miscellaneous section. Now here's Lexi's experience uh, INI. So click on it. Then mod manager download. Good. Close it out. Let's install it. And make sure you change the name. Because you're going to download uh, multiple uh, mods from her page. And if you don't change the name, you're going to end up merging all of them. So scroll down. Lexi's Experience INI. I. Sounds good. Activate it. Let's see if I could endorse this. <gasps> I could. Very nice. Let's delete this. All right. That concludes the perks and leveling section of this guide. And I'm going to end the video there. Thank you for joining me. I hope you're having a good time. And I'll see you in the next video.